Greetings, members one and all of the Salivation Nation. It is a hot summer day. It is July the 21st, 2020. And not only is the temperature very, very hot outside and inside in some cases, but so are the precious metals markets. Indeed. You know, uh, gold is climbing up even closer to record highs, but silver is a big mover right now, up over a dollar right now at $21 on the 21st of July. And uh, interesting and fascinating indeed. Thought I'd just share a quick market update and thoughts about the markets right now. Uh, they're in overdrive this morning, and uh, that could change in an instant uh, in both ways. It could continue to climb up. But the fact that we're seeing $21 silver now and watching the gold to silver ratio narrow down is a positive sign. Now, will that sign continue? Now the gold to silver ratio is below 90. In fact, 87.5 when I checked here. But um, silver is making its move. Um, and um, it's really starting to do what it should have done uh, quite some time ago. Uh, but we still have a ways to go uh, to narrow that ratio. And with the climbing gold prices um, uh, going up, silver is following and, uh, and it is accelerating uh, past gold as we've seen it happen in the past. So essentially history is repeating itself and that's a good thing for silver bugs out there for sure. But I wanna caution you um, not to get over excited or think that silver is just going to skyrocket from here on out. Um, you know, it's a different type of situation we're in these days. Um, and we can't necessarily use history as an indicator here in many cases. However, what we're seeing this morning is essentially that it is starting to perform as it has in the past. Um, this is good news as silver is being seen as a hedge, as a way to protect against economic instability. Silver, you know, the atomic uh, symbol is AG, and it is a unique and fascinating metal indeed. And um, we'll continue to watch it and see where things go. Uh, but, uh, you know, uh, the problem is, and again, as we celebrate... Uh, this movement in silver uh, doing what it has really been supposed to be doing for quite some time. We do it uh, with sort of um, a cautionary um, approach to it. Um, but nonetheless, this is good news to see. Will this be sustainable? I don't know. Um, uh, the jury is out. We've uh, gained a dollar here, over a dollar um, in, the, in the last few hours. Um, and as quickly as it goes up, it can most assuredly go back down just as fast. But nonetheless, I think it is something to note. And, um, you know, this is a not a time I normally post videos. I'm, I've actually stepped away from my workspace to do this. But uh, nonetheless, it's something to keep in mind as a cautionary response. But the market is a buzz, and the community is excited for sure. And we'll see where it goes. Um, I will get really excited if we see a sustained gold to silver ratio um, uh, at less than 70 um, as we move out. Um, and then I'll start to see, to have a little bit more um, faith and kind of seeing silver as that hedge, as that hibernating money. Um, and it will continue to be hibernating money in my view. Um, and But the market is starting to pay attention to silver. Um, and we'll see if it, it remains sustainable. So there you have it. Just thought I'd share my thoughts on this um, mid-morning uh, spike in silver prices. And very exciting indeed. Unless you're a buyer, then it really stinks. Um, but those of you who have been holding silver, um, this starting to pay off as you hold on. It's starting to increase in price, uh, realizing its value. Um, I've always thought that silver was a bit undervalued, but understand the natural market forces that are at play. And uh, I believe that's what we're seeing right now, natural market forces. So there you have it. Post your thoughts in this comment section below. I'd like to extend a multitude of gratitude 
to you all for taking the time to watch and encourage you to please rate, share, comment, and subscribe.